Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Supergeek and today I'm going to tell you about 5 features of iOS 14 which you can get on your Android smartphone. And you won't have to root your phone. I'll tell you about these apps which will give you about the same experience as the iOS 14. So let's start from the privacy feature called Access Dots. So this feature shows a little dot on the status bar of your device whenever any app is using your smartphone sensor like the camera or microphone. This gives you a little information whether the app have some privacy concerns or not. So for Android, you can install the Use Access Dots app, which is available on Google Play Store for free. And this app works just like the iOS 14 Access Dot feature. In Android, this app shows a little dot on the status bar whenever an app is using your camera or microphone. You can customize the dot colors, size and location according to you. The second feature is App Organizer. Apple released a new feature in the iOS 14 home screen which kind of sorts and organize your apps in categorized folder which makes finding an app pretty quick. So if you also keep a lot of apps in your Android smartphone then any custom launcher can help you with that. The only problem is that you have to create categories and folders yourself and manage the apps. But the one launcher which I recommend you is the Poco launcher which does it automatically. The back tap is the feature which iOS 14 has in the beta right now but we're not sure if this feature will make it to the final release but you can get this feature on your android smartphone using the app called back tap this app works just like the back tap feature on iOS 14 except for the triple tap feature you get much more flexibility in this app than the feature on iOS 14 i have a video about this app working so if you want to know about this app in detail Go to the link in the i button above. There is also a link for that video in the description as well. Another feature is about the app permissions. iOS 14 comes with a feature which revokes the permission for the apps which you haven't used for very long. This happens automatically on your phone and you have to give permissions again to the app if you want to run it. The app data stays intact, only the permissions get revoked. So this feature is going to make its way to the Android 11. But not all smartphones are getting Android 11 update like my smartphone, so I can install Bouncer. This app does the same on Android 10 or previous version smartphones. This app is not free, you have to pay 160 rupees to install this app. There is no free alternative for this app right now, but I'll keep you updated if there will be one in the future. The last feature is the in-app search feature which is a universal search for your smartphone. You don't have to go into a particular app to search for something. Just pull up the search and put the keyword. It will search the app for the keyword and shows you the results. So the app called Sesame, which is on Play Store for quite a while, but not much people knows about it. This app does the same on Android. All you have to do is just pull the search and type the keyword. Now tap on the app where you want to start a search for that keyword. And there you go, the app will open with the search results for that keyword. How cool is that? So there you go guys, these were the 5 iOS 14 features which you can get on your Android smartphone without root. So that's it for now guys, hope you liked the video, get subscribed and I'll see you next time.